see that thing? I'm so terrified. It's not gonna make it 100 feet. Apparently the hotel's here as a security measure will lock you in and presumably the bad people out. I don't quite understand what happens in a fire though because it doesn't seem like there's anybody here that has a key. <coughs> oh, wow. I can't even breathe in here. Seriously, there is no way in hell we're gonna make it through this without killing ourselves. There's one place in the world that, that uh, all experience kind of crashes together, where there's immense chaos and beautiful open spaces, and it seems like instead of you know going to look for the experience, if you go to this place, experience, every experience, all experience just finds you and forces you to deal with it, and uh, that's India. And we're here in India probably to do the most idiotic thing that I could possibly think of. We're gonna get in a rickshaw, one of those little tiny three-wheel vehicles that is not made to travel any distance at all with any sort of reliability. And we're gonna put six people in two rickshaws and we're gonna try to drive across the entire length of India. No support, no rules, no roadmaps of any sort of reliability. And uh, let's see what happens. And kind of the whole hope here is just that experience will find us and we'll grow from it, we'll see what it's all about and, and this is India. <laughs>